Trick Daddy has received unambiguous communication from Jess Hilarious, the host of The Breakfast Club, telling him to keep his thoughts about her pregnancy and child to himself. Welcome back, it's your host Nancy Brown. If you are new here, make sure you have subscribed to our YouTube channel. Happy birthday to Jess Hilarious. Yeah, you let a nigga shoot the club up, you get pregnant from a nigga. The non-rapper talked about the new host's newly announced imminent motherhood in a recent Instagram Live video, and he wasn't happy about this development. I'ma fuck that nigga up. Nigga, you, nigga, you done fucked up. You done fucked up now, nah, nigga. You done. But the comedian claims that he didn't stop at social media when making remarks. Trick Daddy ain't hit my phone, right? Yesterday, I was like, you better hope that baby ain't ugly when it come out. She responded in kind at that point, as she clarified on Friday's broadcast. Like, excuse me? Damn. I said, well, it's not yours, so I think we good over here. Mm. Don't ever play with me. Don't ever play with me like that. I know that he loved me and got all the respect in the world for me. I can't where you from? I'm from Baltimore. I don't care where you from. You ain't play with my child. Jess Hilarious previously announced her pregnancy while on the air. Hey baby, hey baby, it's, uh, it's your man. I wanted to call and say happy birthday. Hilarious celebrated her 32nd birthday this morning with her co-workers on the radio. Yeah. I know it's a special day for you. Can't wait to see you. I'm so proud of you. I love it. Her boyfriend Chris made a shocking revelation to the many people who were tuning in when he called in to wish his lover a very happy birthday. Oh, this Chris, this Chris. such an amazing yes. woman. He proudly gushed. So excited for our little bundle of joy as well, baby. Baby, Chris continued, ostensibly confirming Hilarious and her partner's pregnancy. Little bundle of what? Uh, little bundle of joy. You pregnant? <laughs> Although the birthday girl didn't seem comfortable telling everyone, as the Shade Room points out. Yay! <laughs> Chris Hilarious is pregnant! Envy and Charlemagne's actions imply that they were aware of Hilarious' intentions to grow her family beforehand. Chris, congratulations, Congrats. my brother. I definitely appreciate it. Earlier this month, during Country Wayne's appearance on Shannon Sharp's Club Shay Shay podcast, the comic talked extensively about his former partner, Jess Hilarious. Not only did he acknowledge that he had encouraged the new co-host of The Breakfast Club to pursue her career more, but he also came clean about the Baltimore native's lack of honesty in earlier interactions. The host continued to praise Hilarious Wealth even though he was listening to his guest with the same intense attention as before. Oh, Joe, we gotta give a congratulations to uh, Jess Hilarious. She's the new co-host of The Breakfast Club. The former NFL stars, along with DJ Envy and Charlemagne the God, congratulate the wild and out performer on accepting her new role. Just funny now. Yeah, just her funny body now. ain't no laughing matter though. Sharp agreed. I didn't know what? she would like that. What? Oh, her body? He continued, eliciting some shock from his nightcap co-star. Who? Like baby, like my body, yada, yada. Yada, 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 yada. The 55 year old decided to research Hilarious' career further after speaking with Wayne. But when he had a closer look at her posterior, he was obviously preoccupied. He even convinced himself that the picture had been altered. Maybe somebody, I said, hey, maybe somebody photoshopped that. Right, I right, said, let right, me go. Right. Oh, just hilarious. I mean. Yeah. <laughs> In another instance, Country Wayne, the comedian's ex-lover, spoke candidly about her in his Club Shay Shay interview. Those who watched Shannon Sharp's most recent podcast episode with Cat Williams anticipated great things from the host. Thankfully, he and Wayne did not disappoint. Wayne had a wonderful speech about putting his personal goals on hold so that he could devote all of his attention to his kids. Speaking about his previous relationship with Hilarious, the praise the actor implied that there was no truth to previous rumors that she didn't know he was married. Jess, like I always told her, she never tells the... She never tells the 100% truth, and I let her do that, Wayne told Sharp. <laughs> but I tell her the other day, I say, Jess, man, and I got kind of pissed, I said, you gotta get more going on in your career. So they can stop bringing up my name, he added. Saying this going on, that going on, we don't got to down each other. Seemingly pushing his ex to further her career instead of living in the past. Man, a lot of that that she talk about, I let it slide, but man, that stuff ain't play out like that, right. man. Winnie Harlow was referred by Jess Hilarious as borderline weird in a video that she uploaded to Instagram. Yo, Jess, I'm gonna beat your motherfucking ass what the fuck you said about my skin, bitch. Accusing Jess of being a bitch due to remarks Jess made regarding Harlow's complexion. Bitch. I'm gonna get out of here. Bitch. I'm gonna get out of here. Bitch. I'm gonna get out of here. I've never said anything about this bitch's skin, Jess added in her reposting on Harlow's video. Despite Jess claims, people on social media Media are already starting to claim that Jess has previously called Harlow, who has vitiligo, patchy matchy. Girl. Oh wow. Patchy matchy. However, video proof of Jess saying anything about Harlow is yet to emerge online. Moreover, a lot of individuals pointed out that Jess had a history of disputing her remarks about previous people. I'll bet money Jess actually did say something this what she does throw a whole lot of shade then act like a victim when the person say I see you, like this is a pattern app, one person noted. Then she wanna blame it on being a comedian. Girl ain't shit funny, added another. I Jess always wanna play like she don't remember what she said when she get called out, agreed a third. This remains a developing story and will have any updates as and when they emerge. Following Jess's announcement as The Breakfast Club's newest permanent co-host, 
co-host, a quarrel broke out. A year after Angela Yee left the program to take advantage of other possibilities, Hilarious was named the third permanent host of the program. Welcome back it's your host Nancy Brown, if you are new here make sure you have subscribed to our YouTube channel. <laughs> Hilarious said during a press conference about the reveal before Christmas. The announcement coincided with a sharp rise in interest in both Jess and the show. It was revealed that she would be joining the show permanently following her widely shared interview with Sexy Red. Red was quite upfront about her disgust with Jess, which made for an extremely stressful discussion. Who are you, girl? I don't mess with you, Jess. Why? What happened? Jess tried her hardest, but she could never get Red to warm up to her. That's it for today, thanks for watching. Tell us what you think in the comment section and most importantly subscribe. See you.